I'm so sick. I'm so sick. What is up there? What the fuck, man? This fucking 80s shit. What is this? What is this? Every time my hair gets to a certain length, it's like I can't do anything that looks remotely fucking good. Oh, like Ronald McDonald slash fucking, I don't know. What the fuck? Uh, what's up there, guys? It's Exosia Ghostlight coming at you live from death. I'm really sick. I can't stop blowing my nose. I can't stop blowing my nose. And I don't want to go to sleep. It's 5 a.m. I'm afraid to go to sleep because I wake up with all this fucking mucus and I start throwing up. And I'm just like, ugh, I don't want to throw up. I fucking hate throwing up. So I'm like, I don't know. I mean, I could go lay in a fucking comfortable bed right now and I'm not taking advantage of that because I'm I just I'm too afraid to go to sleep. But, uh, fucking shit. I don't even, I can't even, like, make fun of this. Like, uh, not, not make fun of, um, I can't have fun with it. Um, like, I'm not in school anymore, so I can't take off school. Work is, it's the weekend, I don't work on the weekend, and it's like, fuck, man. There's nothing to, like, you know, make this fun. <laughs> uh, I want to eat. I'm hungry, but I, I know that I won't even be able to smell my food or anything, so it's not going to be fun. But I am hungry, so I kind of need to eat. Um, and, uh, I just don't, I don't, I fucking, I don't care about anything right now. Um, I've been laying here watching videos all fucking night. Um, I started... <clears throat> started off watching uh, this two and a half hour interview almost, almost two and a half hours with Leah Remney the uh, actress from like Saved by the Bell King of Queens and blah 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 who left Scientology and she made a series about why she left and some of the fucked up shit about Scientology and I uh, <clears throat> started going down this rabbit hole <clears throat> oh shit oh shit Wait, 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 wait. Uh, oh, God. I'm gonna sneeze. It's it's gonna happen. Oh, fuck. Maybe not. It's going away. Oh, God. My eyes. Uh, Jesus Christ, man. Um... <coughs> Oh, fuck. <clears throat> so, <clears throat> started watching that. Well, I watched the whole thing. And then I started watching, like, other... So I get fascinated by people who leave cults and religions and people who start, like... Because they start thinking for themselves and they start uh, putting effort into, like, looking into why they believe in things. Uh, most of the time it's because their parents made them or because somebody told them about something and they just think, oh, that must be true. But nobody ever really puts any like thought into why they believe in things or why they're wasting their entire lives worrying about things that happened apparently long ago uh, or uh, are going to apparently happen after they die. Like, they don't know. You don't fucking know who wrote the Bible. You don't know who fucking, where all this information came from. You don't fuck. Could have been a bunch of drunk guys sitting around a fire one night. Like, oh, what if we wrote a story about this? Oh, let's just make it all one big fucking book. You don't know. You don't know. Your parents say, oh, this is true. And then you're just like, okay. And it's fucked up. It's sad. And it's, it's not right. And, you know. I've never been a religious guy. I've never been interested in religion. I've never been interested in any of that shit because it's not 
happening now. It's not part of life, and it's not, and it's not real. It's fucking BS. It's it's stories. And if you want to believe in religion, that's fine. That's you know, your choice. You know, obviously, um, I don't have anything against that. I just don't. You know, put some put some thought into why though. You know, you just don't just don't say oh because of this and. This. No, no, think about it, like, you know, look into it, look, you know, don't let them trick you or, or, uh, mold you into thinking that you have to believe everything they say, because they're trying to cover shit up, they're always trying to cover something up, there's always, there's always dirt when you dig, you know, and people don't do that, because they're told you shouldn't do that um, or they're just they believe so much or they want to believe so much that what they're believing is true that they they no, I can't I would never do that I'd never look into that or why you know you just so it, it fascinates me when people are able to get out of the shit and not just not just religious stuff but any kind of cult um, <clears throat> they just mostly happen to be religions or seen as religions um, you know, I, I just, you know, it, it, it just, I like seeing when, you know, when, when people are strong enough to, to think for themselves and, 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 uh, question things. And so, no, I've just kind of been going down a rabbit hole of <clears throat> videos like that. <clears throat> um, I came across some uh, this person who uh, was a former Jehovah's Witness and she, she goes around filming like she's like infiltrating meetings and uh, you know it's just like, <laughs> it's funny you know because nobody nobody I don't know people just don't people don't um stand up to people like that they don't and even if they do get out of it or they do stop believing in something you'll never say anything to anybody that's a part of the thing and it's just like it's refreshing to see people battle you know what's been brainwashing them their entire lives and um you know I don't know. I just find it interesting when, when people are able to do that. Um, <clears throat> anyway, so that's what I've been doing all night. <laughs> so fucking, uh, I don't know what to do now. The sun's going to be up any minute. And I'm just going to be like, oh, I wish I went to sleep. Uh, but I still want to eat. And it's like, I don't know. I don't know what to do. I don't know what to do. I hate being sick. <clears throat> I have to go to Liverpool on Wednesday. I don't have to, but I'm going because I, you know, bought this movie ticket, you know, to go see Best Friends Volume 1. Um, I mean, I have the movie, but I'm going because um, <clears throat> Greg Sestero's hosting, like, a Q&A, and I want to go talk to him. And uh, I don't want to be sick for that. That that would just suck. Uh, that's you know I, I still have a few you know it's Wednesday uh, is when this happens so still have a few more days but um, it always takes me a while to not be sick like at least a week or two I'm always like uh, I can't sing for fucking two weeks it's like I hate it I hate it, it sucks. And then I have to go, I finally got a letter from the ID people in Liverpool, and I don't, I'm guess, I'm assuming they, they got my documents from London, because, um, uh, I feel like the fucking woman cop from Kindergarten Cop, where she's like, uh, laying in bed all sick, and Arnold's like, I will go, you know, and he decides to go take the class, uh, take on the teaching job. She's like, I'm alright, I'll get up. You know, I feel like that. That's what I feel. 
Uh, my face is just like, uh, my ears, I can't hear anything. But what was I saying? Um, yeah, I finally got a letter. I'm assuming they went after my documents and got them um, because they're continuing on with the application. Now I got to go get fingerprints and I got to go. That's a fucking hike to get there. And then it's like, fuck, man. So this is going to be a shitty week for me. I've got the next two weeks off work, which is good for Easter. Another religious holiday. <laughs> like, all these kids, like, love these religious holidays, but they don't understand that they're religious holidays. Like, my whole life. Christmas, Easter, like, I never fucking thought about how, why, like, why they were holidays. I mean, I knew. Uh, I, I actually never, I never really knew about Easter, what the deal was with Easter, uh, until I was much older. Uh, but I knew about Christmas. I knew what Christmas was, but I just didn't give a shit. My, I mean, my family... Uh, oh god my family you know uh, we did Hanukkah and Christmas and I just like hey I get money and presents so you know what the fuck That's, I don't give a shit why they're having these holidays <laughs> you know, I didn't care um, not that you know I care now but I don't give a shit about holidays or anything um, my birthday's on Friday. I keep forgetting. <laughs> I don't fucking, uh, just like, you know, you just don't care anymore after a while about things, um, things like that, you know, when you get older. Uh, right, I'm gonna go, because I gotta figure out what the fuck I'm gonna do before it gets way too early slash late. Um, so I'll see you guys next time. Have fun.